The Mason Minute with Kevin Mason. So I was watching the TV news the other night, and they were doing a story here in Nashville about distracted driving. And they had some state troopers out on a school bus searching for distracted drivers. Now, of course, when you think distracted driving, of course, now you think text messaging. But that's not the only thing they were looking for. They're looking for people paying attention to their radio, paying attention to their GPS. But what really got me bothered was one of my biggest pet peeves about distracted driving is people who were smoking. We were heading up to Indiana over the weekend, and I counted a half a dozen people driving down the road, not paying any attention to what was going on, with a cigarette dangling out the window. Distracted driving comes in a lot of different shapes, forms, and fashions. And to me, yes, text messaging is very dangerous. Sure, so is playing with your GPS, playing with your radio, and even smoking. The one thing they were saying, though, was they'll give you a ticket for a larger amount if you're distracted driving with your radio or your GPS versus text messaging. To me, distracted driving is distracted driving no matter what you're doing. They should be treated the same.